Silicon on sapphire. Sounds pretty exotic. Yeah, it probably is. Uh, a while back I took apart a filament LED light bulb here. Let me just inset the picture of it. Uh, and when you uh, break it apart and extract it, you get these little yellow strands. And uh, the yellow material is a phosphor, and below that are a very large series of LEDs. And uh, let me just another photograph. Uh, if you uh, put an appropriate voltage onto these LEDs, they're all in series. Of course, they glow. And that got me really interested as to uh, how they're constructed. And as near as I can tell, uh, we're looking at a silicon on sapphire process. And uh, let me just uh, open up a picture of my microscope and I have a little exacto knife. And you can see I've, I acid de-encapsulated uh, the filament. It broke into three pieces while I was doing it. Uh, but I stripped away the yellow phosphor and I can take a look at the actual structure. And if you look straight down uh, on one of the filaments, I can see this rectangular series of uh, LEDs. Some are in place and look like some have gotten knocked off. If I understand the process correctly, the uh, silicon is uh, depositioned on top of the sapphire. And then undoubtedly there would have been some uh, uh, conductive uh, layers uh, deposited on top of that. I think the acid is stripped away not only the phosphor but the uh, conductive portions as well. And once that happened, some of the uh, silicon which was depositioned uh, was free to fall off. But um, but a truly exotic process uh, for creating a, um, a lighting.